Child's Play. Shut the killer doll, and I dig it. The movies with our favorite doll, Chucky. Where the hell's Andy? The franchise began from the genius mind of Don Machini in 1988. You stupid bitch! All the way through six sequels. What are you fucking nuts? <laughs> and a horrible reboot with a fucking buddy doll. And a beautiful redeeming TV series with some perfect fucking kills. So today we draft our personal top five. No fucking way! So what child's play film is the best? Who the fuck is Martha Stewart? The original 1988 movie? Hey, wanna play? The sequel from 1990. You little shit! Part three, Andy and the Army from 1991. Presto, you dead. Tiffy time with the Bride of Chucky. I am anatomically correct. The Seed of Chucky from 2004. Why do you kill Bobby, really? The Curse from 2013. You have your mother's eyes, and they were always too fucking close together! The Cult from 2017. Fuck you! The fucking remake. And let's even include the TV series in this draft. A fucking smorgasbord of Chucky to pick from. Andy, how you've grown. And only five can make each list. I can't think of a thing to say. Fuck it. So join myself, Adzi, and Grandpa Popcorn at the bar, as today we will battle it out and draft our best top five films. What will be number one? Who will have the best list? It's all up to you. So sit back, crack a drink, and join us. Let's see some blood. All right, welcome back to the channel. Uh, I'm Rob. Adzi's back again. What's going on, man? Not much, mate. Good to see you. <laughs> same old shit. Same old shit. Just another day. Bloody A. Can't wait and for we're this doing one. Oh, mate, this is going to be a banger. We're doing Chucky and oh. I gotta say, Grandpa is back. Uh, greetings and welcome back, uh, Grandpa. He's back from his coma. <laughs> he was in a coma, so welcome back. Uh, I got emphysema from pumping your great grandma. <laughs> she took my breath away. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> always good. Uh, <laughs> Uh, who could be oh, doing good. who is grandpa? I don't know who he is, but he's he fucked is, up. He's, he's our great great grandpa, man. <laughs> yep. Everyone's grandpa. Um, so he had emphysema, so he's back. So he wasn't <laughs> on the last three episodes, but um, I'm glad he is back. Um, let's do a race, man. Let's do a race. Uh, for oh, before we do the race, I, I, I'm a little bit <laughs> out of it. Let's do the top. Top five rules for child's play. Monster race to get the first pick. Oh, Grandpa made me laugh too much there. Uh, Monster race for first pick. You can have the same picks in this one because it's the Chucky one. Uh, and we start from pick five to pick one, the best. Explain why your movie's in that spot. Um, viewers, they, they they vote in the community section, which is banger. They fucking, uh, the votes are going good, so everyone keep mm. voting. Uh, we appreciate that, and we appreciate everyone fucking uh, still watching. So... We got a zombie race, uh, monster race, zombie race. Oh, nice! Um, your one at the end there, mate. Looks like he's bleeding from the mouth, but uh, that's all right. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he's had a run in with Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> yes. He has. All right, ten seconds on the board, and let's do it. Let's go, zombies! Come on! It doesn't really matter in this one, the Chucky one, but fuck, we want to have a race anyway. Uh, Robbie's, Robbie's got it. Oh! <laughs> that was close. Yeah, shit. That was good. That was close. <laughs> that was uh, pretty fast for a zombie. Um, <laughs> and uh, there's nothing like um, getting to pick after you do a zombie race. Only you two idiots can fuck this up. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> um, okay. All right. So, 
I'm tossing up here uh, in my picks for the fifth pick, which kind of pissed me off um, for the fifth best one. It's really hard because, yes, we can add in the TV series uh, for these picks, but mm -hmm. it was between that and this one, and I'm going with the 1998 Bride of Chucky. Oh, nice one. <laughs> um, I didn't have the same, of, mate. Hey? Uh, I'll tell you if we have the same so we can just go bang, but I didn't have the same. You didn't have the uh, same on that one? No. So we all know why we like uh, the Bride of Chucky. Um, mm -hmm. It's Tiffy time. <laughs> <laughs> indeed, indeed, it's tiffy time. It's fucking tiffy time. The fuck it out, bro. We're going to be uh, all out of sorts in this episode, uh, everyone, but bear with us. Look, Chucky's back after part uh, three. This is the fourth movie. Um, I love this one with um, Jennifer Tilly bringing uh, Tiffany, bringing uh, Chucky back to life, stitching him back. Uh, uh, this has got some fucking good kills in it. It's got some. It fucking, does. It's got some absolute funny fucking moments in this as well. But um, I can't remember his name. But the uh, uh, the family dad that we all love from uh, sitcoms and all that, where he gets all those fucking nails in his face. Holy oh, shit, John Ritter. Yeah, 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 yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's a great one. And uh, Alexis Arquette. Oh, holy shit. And, yeah, some of the kills are so good. And like you said, Jennifer Tilly is um, – it could be on this list, so I'll shut up. But, yeah. uh, <laughs> well, I, Jennifer, I, Jennifer Tilly uh, – John Ritter was wicked. Uh, but Jennifer Tilly was fucking great in this. Um, yeah. I loved it. It was a fucking another banger for the Chucky series. Um, I was torn between this and – I'm not going to lie, the TV series. Um, I'm putting him in my fifth place. Uh, but I'm going with Brighter Chucky because Brighter Chucky just had that – it was a fair few years because I think it was 1991 was um, part three and then this came out in 98 and we'd been waiting for a while for another Chucky movie and we didn't think we'd get another one by the way that the third one ended uh, where he gets chopped up um, in the yeah. amuse amusement park circus place and um, getting stitched back up, brought back to life. And he's so fucking pissed off when he gets brought back to life all the time in all the movies. No! Yeah. no. I mean, this fucking buddy again. Yeah. <laughs> Not again. Uh, but I think this is a banger. This has got a lot of fucking good kills. Um, with Tiffany being introduced into the series because we knew nothing about her for the first three movies, which was great. Uh, no Andy. We didn't need Andy in the storyline anymore because we're going in a different role. Some of the good comedy puns, um, especially where he's uh, having sex. I am rubber, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> um, but I know, you, <laughs> I know you're probably going to elaborate on this one as well. So that is my number five. What would you chuck as your number five there, Adzi? Um, yeah, I mean, uh, yeah, I had a tough time with five as well. Um, yeah. But uh, I'm going to go with Curse of Chuck. Oh, nice, um, nice. Yeah, I think it's number six. And, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, I had a ball with this one. They kind of uh, – uh, I don't like Seed of Chucky. I'll just throw that out there. I fucking hate it. I think it's the lamest piece of shit I've seen in a long time. And I watched it but again. Not as bad as the but not as bad as the remake. Not as bad as the remake, sorry. Yeah. The remake sucks, all right? Yeah. It's fucking bullshit. I hate it. Yeah. But uh, yeah. um, with – with Colt, I think they went back to the roots, and you've got uh, Brad Dorf's daughter in it, uh, Fiona, who's fantastic. I thought, and uh, um, yeah, it's just really, uh, it's really well done in like uh, the one location in the house, yep. and uh, yeah, I really, I, I really enjoy this one, and uh, um, it's got some great kills as well. Yep. And uh, you did say um, curse, didn't you? Not Colt. Uh, curse, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I do yeah, like yeah. Colt as well, but yeah, yeah, I, for, yeah, the, yeah. for five, I'm going to go with Curse. Yeah, and uh, yeah, I I thought it was really good and um, just fresh after that bullshit that was uh, seed. So yeah, that's my it was five. A, it was a whole different. Um, well, I'll quickly go in with my number four is <laughs> Curse. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> So my number four is Curse, so I'll elaborate on uh, Curse a little bit more. Um, 
I just thought, because we waited so long as well, we waited a long time as well, uh, Curse came out in 2013. So yeah. we had a few years in between there. Uh, Don Machini was back, um, yep. which, which helped uh, get the franchise back on a roll. I wasn't impressed when I first, and when I say when I first watched it, I wasn't impressed. I was impressed with the movie. I mm-hmm. loved the movie. I thought it was great. I thought it was a great idea. Um, I didn't like the change of the doll uh, look. Yeah, but I got over that. I got yep. over that. Fucking get over it, you fucking prick. Um, <laughs> Nika. Oh, yeah, boy. I love her. Yeah. Oh, mate. Um, <laughs> Uh, I would do that Nika chick regardless if she was in a wheelchair or not. <laughs> mm, tasty. <laughs> did, say, did, he, did he say vegan chick? Uh, yeah. Nika chick. Nika chick. Oh, I thought you said <laughs> vegan chick. <laughs> no, I didn't know she was vegan. <laughs> not in, um, uh, yeah. <laughs> Nika chick. Uh, I, I like her. I thought she did a very fucking very very good role um, in that. She played it fucking so good. Played a, a, a cripple pretty well because she's not cripple. Um, yeah, she's a good actor, and I'd never seen her in anything before. Before this, um, it was a lot. I know I don't want to bore people. It was a lot. The way it was filmed was a lot darker. Did you notice that um, with this yeah. one? As in like. Scenes that are just half light, half dark. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, yeah. A lot of a lot of blue and a lot of darkness. So I, I liked it. It was um, it was good. Yeah, it was really fresh. Like uh, um, oh. after. And did you know Nika, who plays Nika's uh, Brad or oh, Chucky's uh, daughter? Get out. Yeah. So Brad Dorf, who voices yeah. Chucky through the whole thing, that's his daughter in Get real life. Here. Yeah. No. Bye. No. no. Yeah, yeah, F- Fiona Dorf. Yeah, yeah. Fuck. Plays Nika, yeah, yeah. And uh, she's, she's in Cult as well, and uh, she's in the TV yeah. show as well. And, yeah, yeah, uh, well, yeah. the best scenes from the TV show when she's passionate on with fucking uh, Tippy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, um, but yeah, she's great. And she's she's not just in the Chucky film, she's in uh, different ones, and she's a really good actress, yeah. Uh, she yeah, takes no. after a I thought she was a. I thought she was very good uh, actress. So anyway, that's yeah. my number four, man. What do you got for number four for the Chuckies? I've got part three. Um, part three. Uh, oh, that's nice. Yeah, yeah. I. Uh, I mean, from here on out, I think these are all great. I love the Chucky franchise, and um, yeah. these ones just for me are on a different level than um, uh, the other ones. And uh, um, I love the fact it's at the military school and uh, yeah. the opening's funny as. Yeah. Um, and, uh, yeah, uh, I love the new Andy. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, he's yep. great as well, good actor. And yep. uh, the girl who's uh, um, yeah, kind of got the hot room but in a weird sort of vibe, the way they do that's funny. And yep. uh, that, that paintball scene where he cha- <laughs> Chucky changes it into <laughs> real bullets. I yep. mean, you're not allowed to laugh at it, but I'm giggling my ass off at it because yeah. they're not really likable. That's the other thing. That's how you get away yeah. with the scene like that with the yeah. shooting is that they're not that likable. So you're like, you know, yes, Chucky, but you're not meant to be. But, yeah, and yeah. the ending, obviously, yeah, yeah, you think he's dead for good where he gets chopped up uh, in the fan. But, uh, um, no, nah, uh, I think it's great. Yeah, have a ball with it. No, that's a that's a ripper. I, I've got that uh, in my list as well, so I'll elaborate more on that one uh, <laughs> when I uh, pick it. That was in uh, 1991, that one, and I was stoked when that um, came out on VHS when I got to watch that. When my brother brought that home, I was fucking happy as a pig in <laughs> shit. But, um, and I just really loved the way, the look of the doll back then for the first three movies. So did was, I. Uh, there was yeah. nothing, nothing better than, um, yeah, <laughs> the look of that doll. Uh, so that was your number four. four. Yeah. Okay. So my number. Oh, so we're up to num- I'm up to number three. My number three is. You're probably going to say you got this this far down, but um, I do actually because I've just rewatched them all, and uh, Charles played two from 
1990 Ooh. is my number three. This used to be one of my fucking favourites of all time, but after watching him again, um, I've just really fallen in love with uh, a certain one. one. <laughs> we'll, we'll get into this. Um, Andy's back. Uh, we got Kyle. She's fucking fantastic, Kyle. Yeah, she does. A yeah, good I love job. her. Yeah, yeah. And with uh, Andy at a new um, new foster home now after the uh, first one, and I like how it really um, continues on from the first one. I do love that. Um, but I think it is, um, after watching them again, the only reason why I dropped it down to three was it was a lot kind of the same kind of scenery, same style as number one. I know it's nearly as good as number one, um, but I'll elaborate with my number two later on. Uh, you'll understand why. Uh, but, yeah, this one is fantastic when Kyle takes Andy under his wing, under her wing, and um, they really uh, – they're really fighting, fighting off Chucky and the school teacher bit. <laughs> I'm coming oh, to get yeah, it's, you. It's funny <laughs> shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I won't it's, go too, um, too much on this one yet. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to get too much more in it because I know it's probably uh, where it is on your list. So I'll let no. you bang into this one. But that's my number. <laughs> that's my number uh, three. What's your number three there, mate? No, good choice, mate. Uh, my number three is. Uh, Writer Chucky. <laughs> yeah, nice. cool, cool, cool. yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, exactly what you said. Uh, um, Jennifer Tilly is so fucking good in this film. Um, she's yeah. Yeah, not just gorgeous, she's absolutely stunning. That voice as well, Jesus. But uh, yeah. she just, she's such a good actress in like, uh, um, yep. or actor or whatever you want to say. But yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, fucking, um, and it's just how she taunts him, like, uh, oh, yeah. little baby, you know, and yeah, uh, yeah. throws shit at him. And, and she gets him in the playpen and locks him in there. Yes. Fucking starts torturing him. But the second he gets out, you're like, no, holy shit, it's on now. Yeah. And then he uh, turns her into a, uh, into the Tiffany doll, which these dolls for me, these are like uh, probably the second best in the whole franchise, the way they look. Yeah. They're so well done. And uh, um, I just love the direction. I love the soundtrack. It's banging. Like you got Rob Zombie, you got uh, yep. um, all sorts. And uh, yeah, the kills in this one, are, yeah, brutal. You know the, first, the first four, the soundtracks on the first four are fucking epic. Yeah. Um, all Great. four of them. They all yep. sound fucking awesome. Like, yeah. A lot of people don't really talk too much about uh soundtracks and music from uh movies but they can really make movies um oh, shit, heavy yeah. metal you need heavy metal i need heavy metal Who, in with my these horror movies. <laughs> yeah with these films i don't want to hear fucking nothing against fucking uh bloody uh blink 182 i don't mind them but <laughs> i don't i don't want to hear fucking sugar ray and fucking uh smash <laughs> mouth and, and smash <laughs> mouth and fucking uh Pricks that sing, come my lady, come, come my lady, in a horror movie. You know what I mean? I don't want to fuck up. Oh, I don't oh, want to yeah, R.I.P. to that dude. Uh, I can't yeah, remember. Yeah, yeah, R.I.P. He, he, he was a good I, singer, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, Whatever. I don't want to hear that shit. Well, fucking hell, man. I want to hear fucking, <laughs> I want to hear Rob Zombie and I want to hear fucking, yeah, some good shit. Yeah, but yeah. Bride Metallica of has, shit like that. Yeah, Metallica. <laughs> but it has some good heavy metal in fucking uh, Bride. Yeah, definitely. definitely. And, oh, uh, and before we move on to my next pick, fucking um, that dude with all the Tiffy's uh, Tiffy's <laughs> Tiffy's boyfriend, uh, the one with all the rings on him, is that uh, the one? That looks oh, like that's Marilyn Alexis Manson? Arquette. That's Alexis Arquette. Looks like so Marilyn he, Manson. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's yeah. the brother of Patricia and Rosanna. He's part, oh. and David. So oh, really? All that? Yeah, yeah. They're all brother and sister. So Holy yeah, shit. and yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, uh, yeah, he's fantastic at it. And uh, um, yeah, uh, yeah, awesome character, and the way yeah. he gets killed, <laughs> yeah, he gets fucked up. He gets, fucked he gets up. like yeah. the lip ring ripped out, and then he gets yeah. suffocated in his own blood, and you're like, holy shit! Yeah. He, <laughs> he gets he gets tricked. He gets tricked good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh god, but uh, I love this movie. Yeah, no, nah, it is a banger. Um, <laughs> I'm going to go for my number two. Which everyone will probably be surprised that I put my no number two as number three, but number two for me is part three. Um, and the reason why three just jumped up, and it just jumped up this week because I watched them again, it was so different, but it was the same. If that makes sense, it was like 
because it was in the army now and uh, it was more now there's guns and now there's you know military and now there's older there's older people and and the kills are still fucking fantastic um in the garbage truck that was hilarious where he tricks the fucking garbo to friggin' uh, <laughs> uh, that was such that was such a good kill i love that kill uh one of my favorite kills in there <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. Did you watch it again not long ago? Um, yeah, 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 yeah. The kill, the kill where he goes Rah! to the old uh, sergeant, and he fucking just has a heart attack and dies. And he's like, "You're dies. fucking shitting me! <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me!" <laughs> uh, that oh, was a God. fucking good kill. I it's love a, that kill. <laughs> it's a banger of a movie. It was cool that Andy kind of wasn't really too scared, but he still was a little fucking virgin pussy. Um, uh, <laughs> um, that geek with the glasses that jumps on the uh, grenade, he was just bullied completely in this movie. When you watch it again, you go, holy shit. <laughs> Talk about yeah, fucking no, bullying. No, I didn't like that at all, yeah. That's nah, why I said is- they're all very unlikable characters. Yeah. And, like, when they when certain ones, like, he, he literally, um, he saves half of them, but they're, like, yeah. Uh, um, the ones that do die, like you, you, you know, they're pulling the shit out of that kid, and I hated it. So yeah, um, yeah, uh, yeah. But uh, it's it's well done, you know. I thought nah, that I, bit. I thought it was great. Tyler was great. Um, that little uh, kid was um pretty cool. What a cheeky little fucking prick though. Um, <laughs> fucking sees it's a good guy doll when the package rips, and then fucking uh runs and fucking goes into the closet. I don't know if he came out afterwards, but um, uh, <laughs> but um. Rips it open, he stole it. He fucking stole the doll. Yeah. <laughs> he did, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It kind he of stole the, doll. the whole and thing. It, <laughs> I loved it. it. It really, when I watched him again, even though number two is so fucking good, um, just number three bumped up for me because I was just like, fuck, I hadn't seen this for a while, this one. Um, it was just fun. They're all fun. Look, let's be honest. The first three are fucking fun as fuck. Um, yeah. And this, this, yeah, I, I loved it. But uh, yep, that's uh, my no, num- that's my number two. I had a doll once. <laughs> she got soggy over time. <laughs> <laughs> Dirty prick. Um, so, <laughs> so, <laughs> so your uh, number, your number uh, two, man. Um, uh, yeah, my number two, uh, it might be controversial. I don't really give a fuck. Um, uh, it's, I've got such a soft spot for, uh, part two, which is my number one. My number two is the original Child's Play. Oh, nice, nice. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, and we've- I'll uh, cut you I'll, off for a I, second though, because like I said, the first three are just bangers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 100. And, uh, um. Yeah, uh, you, you, or the first four for me. Like, uh, I've yeah, got three, yeah. four, yeah. Uh, one, two. Yeah, but they're just they're they're brilliant films, you know. And like, you have, um, they're not like brilliant, but they're like they're fun, you know. And that's the whole point of the Chucky franchise. Yeah. Um, but uh, for me, part one is fantastic, just as a film, a beginning, middle, end um, film. It's just yeah. and what a way like to kick it off, you know. It, it's such a great film. And yep. uh, um, Andy's fantastic. Uh, his mum's fantastic in it. Um, Chris yep. Sarandon is the copper. He's great. Um, and like uh, the fact that they, he doesn't b- believe it uh, till like basically the ending, you know, is very realistic. You know, yep. who's going to believe this fucking crazy story? But um, yeah, I, j- I just, and the fact that she's kind of like uh, out on her ass to get this doll for him and she gets him the, the, um, the toy set, toy chest thing first. And yep. it, just that kid, he's so cute. And he's just like, you know, where's the doll for him? Yeah, get him yeah. the doll. And you, uh, in the end, you're thinking, please don't get him that fucking doll. But uh, um, when he finally gets the doll and then – and that scene where she holds him over the fire and, uh, yeah, yeah, and the scene on the elevator where he just uh, – Oh, the old you hear the lady go, <laughs> ugly doll, and you just hear, fuck you. Yeah, fuck <laughs> That's a fucking – that's and, one of my favourite bits. And the ending is banger where he gets absolutely crisp and then he gets shot yeah. and yeah. fucking, yeah, yeah. I, it's so well done. Like, just as a, a suspenseful horror film, it's brilliant. Yep. 
We'll keep yeah, we'll keep yeah. talking about number one because uh, my number one pick is number one. Um, <laughs> and yeah, we'll keep talking about it because for nineteen, it was eighty eight, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So for nineteen eighty eight, um, I just thought it was <laughs> fucking absolute brilliant story. Uh, number one will just never be beat for me. Um, I love the the voodoo guy. <laughs> the, yeah, when Chuck He's great. snaps his things, looks brilliant, looks great. Um, when Chucky fucking tricks Andy to fucking, uh, they're in the snow and they go to that house and blow it up and all that because he's making Andy take him everywhere to kill all his fucking friends for making him get in that doll. Everything yeah, about yeah. it in the storyline is just so fucking damn good. Um, even the cop at the start fucking uh, uh, chasing in the uh, yeah. toy shop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Almost oh, it's getting- brilliant, yeah. Awesome opening and you see all the, the thousands of, or not thousands, but a shit ton of the uh, good guy dolls. Oh. And uh, um and just uh, and freaking Charles Lee Ray's an awesome serial killer. Yeah, and yeah, the voodoo yeah. and uh, all that and uh, yeah, it's just so well done. Yeah, uh, everything, absolutely. Everything Nate about Dunker. it. Everything about it, I love. Um, Aunt Maggie, Aunt Maggie, <laughs> <laughs> and then she fucking fucks off out the window and gets killed. Um, <laughs> yeah, see ya. <laughs> yeah, see ya. I really like the mum. Um, I think the mum. Did a good job. Um, yeah. The mum was pretty cool. Um, she was from Seventh Heaven. <laughs> yeah, she was. Yeah, yeah. Uh, she was the Seventh Heaven lady. Um, yeah. I like that mum chick from Seventh Heaven. <laughs> oh, damn. I'd give her one. <laughs> Grandpa, he's fucking horny tonight, mate. He is. Hey. He's fucking. He's uh, he's come out of his coma pretty well tonight. So he's uh, back on the he's back on the ball. He's actually distracting us a little bit tonight. Um, so number one is my number one. Um, your number one is number two. Yeah, yeah, it's by far. <laughs> uh, this one for me. Uh, this was the first one I ever saw um, back in the day when I wasn't supposed to, but. Uh, yeah, yeah, it was like it was in the M-rated film over here, so it was um, easy to kind of sneak it in. Uh, but the yeah. cover is awesome; everyone's going to remember the scissors. Yeah, yeah. Uh, sorry, Jack, Chucky's back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, the cover of the VHS was fucking sweet. Yeah, and uh, I want that poster. But uh, yeah, um, yeah. It's just for me, like, and I love Kyle as uh, the final girl. I think she's fantastic. She's excellent. And uh, um, you can tell she's been through some shit already in life. You know, she's only yep. young and she's already been through a lot uh, for yep. foster home to foster home. So I really like that um, ca- character arc about, about her. And, uh, um, again, Andy's fantastic. The little boy who plays Andy. Um, yep. And, uh, uh and it's got the girl out of uh, American Werewolf who, uh, as the mum, and she's great, and yep. um, uh, she gets off <laughs> as well. Um, I'm glad they got yeah, Andy this... back. I'm glad they brought yeah. the same actor back. Yeah. Oh, I mean, and hopefully, yeah, they gave him some money, you know, because, uh, yeah. uh, you know, uh, sometimes they don't treat the child actors with the, the best way, you know. But no. uh, that ruler scene. Uh, it was like yeah. you're saying, it's so much fun, and it's yep. uh, it's got the the bitch from freaking Donnie Darko, uh, Sparkle Motion lady. Um, yeah, uh, fuck her. Yeah, yeah, she's a bitch. <laughs> and uh, um, but uh, there's so much uh, great stuff in this, and like, uh, yeah, it's got a soft. Uh, I'm very soft on this one because uh, I love it, and I have watched it. A lot. <laughs> so. Now, look, I I know exactly uh, where you're coming from on this one because um, when I was younger, number two was always my favourite, more than number one. But re-watching them, fucking mm. two had bumped down from number one down to fucking number three for me. <laughs> I don't yeah. know why. Maybe because I've seen it so many goddamn times. But I tell you what the brilliant thing about because, like, Number one is a 10 out of 10 for me, and number two and three are eight out of tens for me um, on equal uh, points there. But um, i got to say, the way they bring him back, um, scraping all the burnt off him and all that, is it's fucking brilliant. brilliant. It looks and the ending, fantastic. the ending in the toy, yeah, and the ending in the toy factory, you're like, yep. it's never going to leave my mind. It's just so well done and, like, so suspenseful, and the bit with the guy with the eyes who gets the yep. the plunged eyes into him, yeah, it's I'm just happy. some. 
But that's why I was saying to you um, with number three, why number three bumped up to me because the ending of number two, two is so awesome. The start of number three is fucking wicked. When there's it all is. spider webs in the fucking warehouse and they pick up this blob of melted fucking uh, plastic and it bleeds into the thing. And then right as fucking Chucky's created, he goes, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And it like dives. It has that shot of it going into the into the darkness. And yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, three's awesome, man. Yeah. Um, uh, all three of them are fucking wicked. All four. The first four are yeah. fucking brilliant and curse. So actually we had... Let's go. We got all different on the, ones. <laughs> hold on, no, because let's chuck up on the uh, screen. Every single one of them, we had this. Uh, not in the order, but we had all the we had the same five, but in different orders. So, different order, yeah, yeah. So your that's, that's funny. <laughs> yeah. So your fifth was curse. My fifth was bride. Um, yeah. Your fourth was number three. My fourth was curse. <laughs> um. <laughs> Your third was Bride. My third was Part Two. Your yeah. second was Part One. My second was Part Three, and <laughs> you had Part Two as number one, and I had number one as number one. So you know what? They're pretty. Uh, we both got good box sets. <laughs> we both got the same box sets. <laughs> <laughs> we just watch it in different orders. <laughs> yeah, in different orders. So uh, if you're gonna vote, everyone. Um, on a serious note, uh, definitely have a vote. And um, yeah. Grandpa wants to say something. Uh. <laughs> no one picked the remake. Oh, I'm so shocked. <laughs> Fuck that movie. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Fucking exactly. Fucking load um, of shit, mate. <laughs> load of shit, the remake. We don't even want to fucking talk about that piece of crap. So that's our top five in different orders. We've got the same movies. Uh, vote in the uh, community section which top five you think is the best. End of the year, we're going to be doing a fucking end of the year live. Uh, the final count. The final count to see who wins season one. Season one mm -hmm. of the movie draft. The best goddamn draft that there Fuck is. Right. God damn internet. <laughs> Two watches. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, people are loving it. Thanks for watching, everyone. Like, subscribe, do what the fuck you want. Say hi to your mum for us. Adzy30 on Instagram. I'm Popcorn1 on Instagram. Uh, Grandpa is asleep at the bar now. He's drunk. And uh, <laughs> we'll be back next time. Uh, whatever the fuck we do, we'll be back. See you. Bye-bye.